morning in transit on the couch. I hope you have been enjoying our Names of God series. Today, uh, we are going to be hearing from my dad, Paul Menz, as he shares about the name Father. Kids, um, this is Sarah's dad coming to you. She texted me the other day while I was on the trail and asked me if I could talk to you about one of my favorite names of God. And so I when I was talking, uh, I thought, now, who do I, how do I call God when I'm praying? And usually what I say to him, I said, my Heavenly Father. And so I want to talk to you about the name of God that's Father. And part of what I think impresses me about that part of it is I'm a father, um, but also I have a father, and my father has helped me to understand the Father God. And uh, in thinking about my father and thinking about God, the father, um, I think that helped me when I was raising our kids in understanding who a father is, what a father does, that kind of thing. And, and so I want to talk to you about um, God, our father. One of, the, um, one of the important prayers that I grew up was what they call the Our Father, um, that's found in um, part of the Sermon on the Mount in Matthew and, and Luke, I think it is. Um, and it's, it starts out, Our Father which art in heaven. That may be familiar to you. Um, but it's a, it's a good way to talk to God, to reference Him, because He is um, our Heavenly Father, our loving Heavenly Father. When I think of my dad, um, he, uh, he was a good father. He raised us, um, he took us to church, um, he, was, he was the one that made sure that, that the, the household, well, I don't know, um, worked right, and um, he didn't do everything, obviously. My mom um, was very much active in the home, but I think she could be active in the home because of his loving her, not as a father, but as a, as a husband, uh, but that that's a part of his being a father to to love uh, our mother and help us to understand what a father is all about what he does and uh, my dad was a he was a good worker he was uh, he was a good um, he was a good father and there were times when he would have to talk to us and sometimes he'd have to talk to us with uh, they used to have a board that they used uh, the board of education we called it a paddle I'm sure we were uh, deserving of that. But anyway, he, um, he was a good father. And, I, and I, thank, um, I thank God very much for my good father because he helped me to understand how to be a father, but also he helped me to understand who God is as our father. And um, a father is one who provides for his family he provides physically, but he also provides emotionally, mentally, psychologically, a lot of these fancy words. Um, a father does many, many things for his family. And you think in terms of wanting to have good times with your father, and that's a part of what a father provides, but it's a whole lot more than that. Because sometimes, as you're growing up, someone needs to help you with well, I don't know, you've got a behavior that's not real good. And a father is one who will help you with that. Well, our Heavenly Father um, is very much like that. He wants us to be, um, he wants us to be, I don't know how you describe it, he wants us to be holy, that's one of the words we use in church. But he wants us to be a whole person. And, uh, and so he brings things into our lives that help us to grow and develop. And sometimes that means discipline. Sometimes that means, um, again, that old-fashioned concept of spanking. I don't know if your parents spank you these days. We spanked our kids. Um, I remember one time, I know I'm going a little uh, a field here, but I remember um, Joe would get into trouble. Joe was our, our son, a middle child. And uh, I would talk to him about his behavior, and then I would ask him, what do you think I should do to help you to control your behavior? And he would look at me and he said, I, I think maybe you better spank me. And, and I think that that's a good, that's a part of what a father does. A father has to help us to, to think right, to grow up right, to be what 
what he wants us to be. And, and that's not an easy thing for a father to do, um, but I believe a very necessary thing for a father to do. And I'm very, very grateful that our Heavenly Father um, disciplines us as well as loves us and provides for us and, and all of the other things that he does as a father. So I'm, I'm, I'm very glad for the name Father and I'm very glad that God is, is my father. I hope he's your father also.